Let's do one more modeling small stool with the help of SolidWorks weldment feature. Here we have different types of pipe. Uh, we have two types of pipe 25 into 2, 2 millimeter is the thickness, diameter 20 and 25, dimensions in millimeter. Okay. Now here one, uh, let's say side view, there is a one section view B. See, this is the section view B. Then there is a one, uh, let's say this is a bottom view. Okay. And uh, there is a section view A, you will see here. So first we will create this base uh, two pipe 25 diameter into two. We will create this pipe, one pipe here, one pipe here. These radius 25, this corner fillet 50. Center to center distance 350 and how much height? height you will see here from here to here height 100 millimeter okay and uh, you will see these pipe locations 45 degree first we will create then we will uh, move okay then there is two small pipes 20 diameter see these two pipe this pipe diameter uh, pitch circle diameter 290 and uh, gap between these two 20 and how much this location 20 okay location here 20 millimeter that's the location and 305 millimeter is the pitch circle diameter for this pipe okay let's create this first front plane sketch activate corner rectangle Now select center point, hold shift key, line, midpoint. This is important. Bottom line, make it construction line. And you will see this uh, corner fillet R30. Okay. First, 350. 100 millimeter sketch fillet 30 millimeter and select two edges say okay now let me cancel this right plane sketch again i'm going to select cor center corner rectangle it makes help us now select center point line midpoint bottom line convert into construction line activate circle okay trim entity power trim keep trim entity as construction line and delete these two lines okay now let's apply some dimensions this is also 350 100 millimeter fillet 30 select these two okay then change 50 apply here okay it's difficult to choose let's finish this okay smart dimension sorry we have to apply like this okay there is a some mismanagement select this one and this one coincide it is in one line okay we lose center position see 350 divided by 2 now simply exit go to weldments activate a structural member iso standard pipe and here uh, we first we have to apply 25 into 2 but uh, it is not available so we will modify this one 25 into now let me choose 
first group one now in first group there are many segments so i am going to select all one by one now here select new group new group select this second line okay <coughs> Now let me select front plane sketch activate circle let's draw here two circles okay select both circle equal relation draw one center line vertical okay the smart dimension 20 okay now select these two tangent tangent smart dimension distance hold shift key we already defined select this edge hold shift key select this upper edge 20 <coughs> now this is fully defined now this pitch circle 290 i think revolve boss base feature now see center line selected as a axis of revolution 360 unmerge and here apply thin feature thickness 2 mm reverse one direction okay see but we need to change position go to direct editing move now let me select this all even this two you don't need but this is align with this so rotate origin forty five degree given see it is going to rotate okay let me check one more time edits uncheck copy okay otherwise you will make copy hide these drawings now <coughs> let me apply some color let's say body now the first let's say pink the top one okay again edit feature clear select body yellow bottom one clear body the green one make this one okay fourth i am just repeating the things okay now let's make this rest now these rest you will see first see there is angle given 45 this is important now 120 mm this is also important distance from center to center this is the critical part of this and uh, okay we will use this two feature and uh, location 20 mm see here from this center point of this pipe so if you count from outside because uh, 10 mm because the diameter is 20 and then see here location 10 mm from this pipe okay and height 300 mm the corner radius r30 see here bottom also r30 and uh, you will see this pipe 220 into 2 now select front plane sketch activate line okay 
ओके दिस इज हॉरिजोंटल लेट्स स्मार्ट अप्लाई डायमेंशंस 300 मिलीमीटर 120 नाउ लोकेशन फ्रॉम हियर टू दिस एज पाइप अपर एज ओनली 10 मिलीमीटर ओके एंड डिस्टेंस फ्रॉम हियर टू दिस पाइप सेंटर पॉइंट 20 मिलीमीटर फिलेट 30 एंड सिलेक्ट दिस एज ओके कैंसल नाउ ओके लेट मी डू वन थिंग ड्रॉ वन वर्टिकल सेंटर लाइन बिकॉज दिस इज एक्सिस ऑफ रिवोल्यूशन मेक श्योर इट इज वर्टिकल गो टू फीचर अप्लाई हियर रिवॉल्व बॉस बेस एंड हियर सिलेक्ट नो ओके हियर चूज फोर्टी फाइव डिग्री एंगल गिवन बट हियर सिलेक्ट मिड पॉइंट सो दैट मटीरियल फ्लो बोथ साइड इक्वली डेप्थ मेक इट टेन मिलीमीटर सो इट लुक्स मोर विजिबल नॉर्मल व्यू लुक मटीरियल फ्लो इन साइड वी नीड आउटसाइड लाइन दैट्स वाई वी कीप दिस वन अनमर्ज रिजल्ट ओके बट ओके डू वन थिंग राइट क्लिक आइसोलेट नाउ लेट्स कंप्लीट दिस वन स्केच कन्वर्ट एंटिटी लाइन एंड कनेक्ट दिस टू मेक इट स्ट्रेट लाइन बिकॉज आर पाइप हियर इज स्ट्रेट एक्सट्रूडेड बॉस बेस नाउ सिलेक्ट दिस रीजन मेक इट रिवर्स There is a no next option, so choose your surface up to back surface. Say okay. Copy, ed edit, make sure merge result. See. Now these faces should be parallel to these faces. That's why the line uh, pi pipes are uh, in e symmetrical position. direct editing face move i want to move this face select this face rotate face axis of rotation select this outer line now here you have to apply angle total angle 45 degree divided by 2 flip material now you will see how material going to flow here say okay similarly do for other side now here select this axis 45 by 2 see this phase move like this okay now look it's perfectly defined now go to fillet constant type symmetric and radius 30 mm now select this edges because this is structure we need to use for pipe path now i am going to use swift boss base feature circular 20 now let me select this one okay clear right click selection manager here choose group make sure you selected group if you choose one it will show you this symbol so click this one and it will show you, show you all tangent line together say okay see close loop selected 20 thin feature diameter 2 mm inside and here keep direction one means material flow in only one direction not both side here also uncheck merge result okay direct editing delete or keep body delete body select this uh, solid body delete now we have a pipe clear select the pipe okay exit look what we done 
Now, at there is a base plate. Thickness 10 millimeter, 35 dia, four numbers. Okay. Then there is a cushion. 80 millimeter depth, diameter 300, corner radius 10. And location you will see here 32.5 mm millimeter from this pipe. Okay. Now here go to weldments, activate end cap, select faces. Now here thickness direction, outward, thickness make it outside. Now here thickness, total depth of this plate 10 millimeter. Now here offset value, offset from the uh, pipe diameter, this diameter how much, 25. So 5 millimeter outside from one direction. So 5 plus 5, 10, 10 plus 25, 35 millimeter. Okay. So here, let me choose all four edges. Uh, sorry, uh, faces. Isometric view. Now see the preview. Say okay. Top plane, these pipes located at top plane. Sketch. Activate circle. Okay. Now this diameter how much given? 300. 300 millimeter. Extrude. Here choose blind. And depth how much? 80 millimeter. But. Normal view. Okay, let me choose this view. Offset. Offset value how much? 32.5. See, 32.5 millimeter from the center of this pipe to here. I think we done something wrong with this pipe. Okay. Fillet. 10 millimeter constant size select the face it will select both edges say ok ok this is unmerged result simply uncheck I am going to edit this clear select here body and uh, this one I am going to choose this select this color even you can do this ok here we done. Don't forget to share and like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in Soidworks. Thanks for watching.